10th April 2020. It's Good Friday. Today, I go back to another 10th April, 1938, when a child was born in the Netherlands, Franz van der Lucht. He later on joined the Society of Jesus, became a missionary, and spent the best years of his life in Syria. On the 7th of April 2014, he was brutally murdered. What did France do? Abuna France, as you are so lovingly called. He gave the world three beautiful interrelated messages, which in a way sum up discipleship and Jesus on the cross. His call was a call to courage. His call was a call to compassion. His call was a call to commitment. And this is what he lived and epitomized throughout his life. Franz, Abuna Franz, was a very courageous man. He reached out to those who needed him most, the physically and the mentally handicapped, the youth, children, the lonely, the adults, it doesn't matter who. He was courageous enough to trek with them, to go into the mountains, to bring Muslims and Christians together. Throughout his life, he showed a deep compassion, compassion to anyone and everyone, to nature, to people, to the task he was entrusted to. Above all, he was committed till the very end, till life was snatched away from him on the 7th of April, 2014. This was the day he was born in 1938. And today as we remember Jesus on the cross, we remember Jesus' call to each one of us, a call to be courageous, a call to be compassionate, a call to be committed in our world today. As we gaze at Jesus on the cross, we need to ask ourselves, we need to ask Jesus on the cross, Lord, what more can I do for you in our world of today, which has been gripped by this pandemic? How can I be more courageous? How can I be more compassionate? How can I be more committed? And in that silence, Jesus will look down upon us and give us his answer, the courage, the compassion, and the commitment to be his witnesses in our world of today. Father, into thy hands I commit my spirit.